Democrats say the latest $1.5 trillion farm bill does not support Wisconsinites. Madison Area Congressman Mark Pican and 3rd Congressional District Candidate Katrina Shankland hosted a virtual press conference today after the House Ag Committee passed its version of the farm bill. Current 3rd District Representative Derek Van Orden sits on the Ag Committee. Pican and Shankland say Van Orden didn't do enough for Wisconsin farmers because Southern crops got greater subsidies than Midwestern crops like corn and soybeans, and funding for the Dairy Business Innovation Initiative went down. Their biggest issue though is with SNAP, the Low Income Food Assistance Program. The nonpartisan Congressional Budget Office says this farm bill will limit the factors used to calculate benefits, which result in a reduction of about $30 billion to the program over 10 years. Van Orden this week said Democrats are lying when they accuse Republicans of cutting SNAP benefits. But Cannon Shanklin pushed back. For the next five years, there will be no increase to the SNAP benefit. If you get $6 a day, and in five years you have $6 a day, Milk is going to go up and other commodities are going to go up and you will be able to buy less and less. We know that for every dollar we fund in SNAP, it generates almost two dollars in local economic activity. And a lot of that really creates local jobs in rural communities. The bill passed out of committee on a 33 to 21 vote with four Democrats in support. In a message posted to his congressional page, Van Orden said passing the farm bill is, quote, the best thing we can do for our farmers and for those most in need.